I honestly don't even know how to start this video without completely freaking out. But I'm sure from the title of this video, you already have an idea of where I'm going with it. And unless you guys have been living under a rock, you've probably been hearing a lot about artificial intelligence and this thing called ChatGPT, which stands for Generated Pre-Training Transformer. We are talking Chat about ChatGPT. ChatGPT Chat is, is capable one of, of engaging in human-like right conversations. But in this video, I'm going to be going over how this insane AI tool can be implemented into your Shopify dropshipping stores to help you run it like an absolute boss and start generating some serious bread. Now, whether you're just starting out or you're already killing it in the e-commerce space, I think this tool is not only going to save you a ton of time, but also help you brainstorm super creative ideas for your e-commerce brands. So let's get right into it. But before we hop into this video, we're going to continue with the giveaway for this week, which is a completely free Shopify dropshipping store built by my team. Now, all you gotta do is like this video, be subscribed and comment either something insightful or any question that you have. And I'll be announcing the winner in next week's video. All right, so first of all, what is ChatGPT? Essentially, it's a language processing AI that generates human-like responses. It's like having a genius assistant that you can ask any question at any time without it getting tired. So if we think this could save companies potentially hundreds of thousands to millions of dollars per year. And I do gotta shout out my homie Steven for showing me the capabilities of this tool. It's gonna be a serious, serious game changer. But let's talk about the capabilities of this chat bot and how it can help you run a brand new or already existing Shopify store. By the way, this is not a sponsored post. I'm literally just showing you guys how much this software can help you grow your e-commerce brand. So one of the first things it can help you with is coming up with super detailed product descriptions in literally seconds. And it's always going to be important to have these fire product descriptions that really sell the features and benefits of your products. So what we could do is go onto my computer and feed it some information about the product and it's gonna copyright a description. Let's go ahead and do that right now. So if you guys watched one of my last videos, I created a brand new Shopify store from scratch. So we're gonna be using this example store to uh, create some of the product descriptions. So what we can do right here is go directly to the products. Let's try and find the first product that I created. Yeah, so this was the one. And this was just a basic, very generic product description that I copied and pasted. First, what I would wanna do is select all the text. So let's try and remove these images real quick. There we go. And we just command control Z. But let's just select all the wording first. So uh, command Z, and place them all back. And then we're gonna go here to chat GPT. And then try the chat. Here we are at the chat. And then this is the initial product description that I just grabbed from an example store, right? So this is kind of the general basis. We're giving it this information, right? So what I can do at the very bottom is say, all right, make me a product description that is similar to this one, please. <laughs> okay, now let's see what it comes up with. All right, it's already computing. Introducing the Samurai Shield Umbrella, designed by former Samurai and Kendo Masters. This umbrella is the ultimate defense against any weather. So what we can also do is say, expand on this description, product description, but this time add bullet points. Like I said, it's like having a virtual assistant. It's pretty crazy. So now it's gonna add some virtual, uh, sorry, now it's gonna add some bullet points. Look at that, that is insane. So what we can do here is copy this right here, place that there, and then from here, these bullet points, right? I mean, you can give or take any of these uh, related sentences, but it's really cool to just give a basis, right? And even if you don't like this, what you can do is say, I'll say, give me another description for this product, but make the lingo more Japanese oriented. Let's see what it computes right here. I don't know, let's just find out. This is a product card in the utmost attention to detail and authenticity. Okay, let's, let's try this. Make a more interactive 
description, please. Let's see what it comes up with. Are you ready to embrace your inner samurai and take on the storm that comes your way? It's pretty cool. So that's one really cool feature. What we can also do so that we don't completely copy this initial product description. And then we can say, recreate this product description, but in different words and with informal lingo. If you're ready to tackle a storm that comes on your way, you need the katana umbrella in your life. This babble was done with XM Kendo Pros and handcrafted to give you the most authentic katana handle. This is pretty cool. And then watch this. Now we can say formal, and then now it's gonna make it completely formal and sound like an actual human. This is insane. It gathers all this information and basically computes a new description for you. So like I said, you can either give or take any of this information. If you liked what was here, then you can keep that. Uh, but it's really just a helpful tool rather. Trying to go in and write product descriptions is so, so time consuming. And if all you can do is just copy, paste, make me a new one. This is AI, look at this. And before an AI bot like this, it generally takes a ton of time to come up with something that's going to be both enticing to the audience and informative about the product capabilities. But if you guys think this is really cool, wait till you see what I have in store for you guys. Okay, so this feature I found is actually nuts, simply for how creative it is. Now, a lot of you guys don't know exactly what to sell, or maybe you do, and you already have a winning product, but want to expand on the product line, what this tool can do is give you new innovative product ideas that you can then go ahead and brainstorm with within your dedicated niche. So let's look at how I'd go about product research for an existing niche I'm selling in. Now let's go ahead and use the example store. So we can go here and check out the other products that I have. I was selling really only the samurai umbrellas, right? So the first unit, which is the black one, the red unit, and then the white unit. So what I can do is say, all right, let's go to chat GPT and say, um, I am selling uh, samurai umbrellas. What other innovative ideas do you have? Here are a few ideas, samurai sword handle canes, samurai inspired phone cases. These phone cases could feature samurai inspired wallets, samurai inspired watch bands. Duh. Okay, so the first one seems pretty interesting. So I like this first one. Right, so what we can do is go onto AliExpress and see if that's even a viable option or a product that would be enticing to go ahead and try and sell. So let's go to AliExpress real quick. All right, so we are at AliExpress and let's see, let's copy here. Samurai sword handle canes. Oh, so it's okay. So it's a cane that looks like a samurai sword. So that could be something interesting. Um, there's samurai mini keychains. So that could be something as well, but it's really cool to just give you ideas and help you brainstorm. Let's see what this is. Uh, Dragon Claw with ball luxury walking stick cane. So that's kind of cool actually. So it can give you all, all kinds of product ideas. I mean, doesn't matter what you're selling, right? If we go in here and pick a random random product. Okay, right here. So let's go for this car washing uh, sprayer. What are some other products I can sell for my car Sorry. car wax and polishes and just see how detailed it is it's crazy detailing brushes and sponges car air fresheners window cleaning products so you know sometimes when you're stumped and you don't know uh what new products that you could potentially launch for your store you can use this as a great tool to give you ideas brainstorm and then from there narrow down and list some of the products that you like so let's say uh we like one two and three so say like I like products one, two, and three. Can you find me products that are similar to these? Car paint sealants, clay wire kits, wheel and tire cleaners. Oh my gosh. If it gives you any good ideas, uh, you can jot those down and use that for your potential product research and testing. So now let's go on to the next thing this AI tool can help you with. All right, so the next thing this AI tool has the capability of doing is customer service. So gonna answer questions like shipping updates, return policies, and product information, you just gotta feed it that initial information. What we can do is try a quick example email response, let's hop back into the computer and see what it spits out. So go to settings, go down to policies, and then we're gonna copy this, 
and then C, control C. Let's feed it this real quick. It's gonna summarize it, but let's just feed it. And then we're gonna say something like, let's do this. Um, my customer uh, asks what the refund policy is, response to that email. And yeah, as you can see, it summarized it, but as you feed it more information, it will retain that and then use it in your responses. So it knows everything up to here, right? So now it's gonna start, sure. Here's a brief response to your customer. Customer's question about the refund policy. Dear customer, thank you for your email and for your interest in our store. Our refund policy is outlined in a return policy section of our website. In general, you have 30 days after receiving your item to request a return. In order to be eligible for a refund, the item must be in the same condition that you received it unworn and unused with tags. If your return is approved, we will issue a return. Like, this is insane, right? Just think about how much time this saves. People are gonna lose a lot of jobs for this. Look at how crazy this is. We could even say like, make this informal. Hey, thanks for reaching out and for your interest in our store. Our refund policy is pretty straightforward. You have 30 days after receiving your item. To <laughs> let's see if, I don't know if this is gonna work, but let's see if this works. Answer this email now, but like a cow boy. <laughs> what? <laughs> let's just see if this works. There's no way. If this actually works, it'd be crazy. Oh, oh my God, this is, this is insane, howdy. Even like, let's say your customer is from Spain, your customer is from Germany, let's see. Translate Spanish. Gracias por su correo electrónico y por sus interés en nuestra tienda, nuestra, su artículo para solicitar una devolución. Let's try and do some more stuff. Let's see if we can even do the shipping policy. Dun, here is my policy. Let's see, uh, my customer is asking about the processing time of each order. Please write a detailed response to their inquiry. And duration of each order. Dear customer, thank you for your email and for your interest in our store. We're happy to provide more information about the processing time Processing shipping times for our orders. Processing time after you place your order, it goes through verification quality. Check process before it shipped to the manufacturer for tailoring if Apple is in 24 hours. I really need to overlook it too much. Like, look at how detailed this answer is. And the English is insane. And this actually leads us into the next capability, which is email marketing. And so for even like a blog post, I can feed it a bit of information about my brand or the products that I sell and get it to write out a super detailed email for me. So we can go ahead and try to do that right now as well. And like I said before, we can make it formal, we can make it informal, we can make it sound like a cowboy, we can make it speak another language. What we can do right here for the blog post is say, I have a samurai umbrella. Come up with a list of blog post ideas. Let's see what it comes up with. Here are your blog post ideas, samurai umbrella. The history of samurai umbrellas from ancient Japan to modern day. <laughs> It's not always gonna be accurate, but the benefits of using Samurai Umbrella, but it's pretty damn good. So let's try number three. So I like number three. What I could say is, can you make outline for uh, number three? Detailed outline for a blog on the five fun and creative ways to style your umbrella. Style number one, style number two. Let's say we liked number two, right? So let's say scratch the, uh, number three, let's say make a blog post for number two. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay, and then I can say make this blog post more informal. Hey there, if you're in the market for a new umbrella, you might wanna check out Samurai Umbrellas. These bad boys are not only super stylish and cool, but they also have some serious benefits that make them worth considering. Like you can literally have series of content just lined up in minutes. And then check this out. And then we can also say, all right, um, I want to run a New Year's My Samurai. Can you come up with a with a detailed email for my customers dear value customers we hope this email finds you as well as you simply use promo code we'd say can you shorter and lingo hey there all right so that's it for what i wanted to show you for the email marketing what we can do now 
is talk about ad campaigns. And I'm still learning a ton about this tool, but the last thing I'd learn to be very useful is copywriting my ad campaigns for just when you're running Facebook and Instagram ads. And let me show you what I'm talking about. So in reference for my example brand, let's say I wanna run an ad on this product. Let's go ahead and make a quick ad copy using this AI tool. What I can do, very simple, say, hey, I want to make a Facebook ad for this umbrella buyer ad copy. Sample Facebook ad copy for your Samurai umbrella. Attention Samurai enthusiasts. Introducing the ultimate umbrella for any weather. Samurai shield umbrella designed by former Samurai and Kendo Warriors. The umbrella is built to withstand even the strongest winds and storms. It's aerodynamic. So like I said, it retains all this information. So if you just feed it a bunch of stuff about your brand, it will be able to understand what you're getting at and then gear towards more of a detailed response according to what you put in. Let's see, make this Facebook ad shorter outline. So the title, be a samurai, were in any weather. So here's a list that you can use, then the call to action, order now and ready for any weather. As you know, Facebook ads, it's gonna have the, the call to action. Generally it's gonna be shop now or learn more. And then here would be like the title or the description and then key points. And this is what you can use as the description for your Facebook ad. So Facebook ad, uh, it would be at the top, Instagram ad, it would be at the bottom, and then you'd have the uh, title and then the description under it, and then of course, call to action. And if you liked this version, you can keep it, or you can say, come up with another version, but with this format. Upgrade your daily walk with the Samurai <laughs> game. And see, it comes up with an entirely new Facebook ad, and in the same format, in less than a minute, we have a series of Facebook ad copies that we can go ahead and use on our Facebook ads to go ahead and potentially make some serious bread. So that just about wraps it up for what I wanted to show you guys about ChatGPT. Uh, you can kind of think of it as a virtual assistant, as I said before, that's gonna work for you whenever you want for free, at least for now. So try and take as much advantage of it before they decide to monetize it. I don't know if they're going to monetize it, but they might monetize it. So do try and take advantage. I really hope you guys were able to find this video useful. Don't forget about the giveaway for the free custom built Shopify store. I'll see you guys in the next one, unless I get replaced by AI. <laughs> Peace.